What's up, my YouTube people? I am just finishing up my Taser Instructor Class 2013. So I've just researched for two more years. Um, if you need training, want training, you're out of state, whatever, I will come to you. Firearms training, any type of non lethal training for your um, security companies, police departments, whatever. Um, I can train anything from the ASP to the TASER to OC nationally. Uh, as far as firearms, I'm working on getting a lot more states under my belt to uh, to qualify to, to certify other state security officers and, and the way it looks, some police departments in other states also, but I wouldn't go that far. Anyhow, the reason why I make this video is because I've been seeing some things uh, that I thought need to be addressed. Not me personally. Well, actually I have one personally. Whoever you are out there watching my videos and within the first two seconds you're clicking the dislike button. Go do something with yourself. Get a life. Alright? That's first thing first. Let me tell you guys, if you don't have haters, you ain't doing nothing right. Okay? I got haters out there that like to click dislike on my videos on the first two seconds. I'll post a video up and I'll go to the thing after it processes and I will see a dislike on it. That's not possible. <laughs> it's not possible at all. Alright? If you want to do something more interesting, go get your own YouTube channel, get your own videos, get your own subscribers, and make yourself happy. <laughs> it doesn't really bother me. I just think you need to get a life. Beyond that, the thing I saw today that kind of uh, made me make this video is giving props where props are due. And I wanted to put this on my training website because a lot of people tend to take advantage of uh, others, but they don't give them the well-deserved uh, you know, reward that goes to the person who created the thing in the first place. Now, I'm not talking about anything that happened personally to me. It's something else that I saw that, you know, just really just disturbed me. It's like you see somebody doing something really good and they're doing it for you and you don't give them the credit. It's kind of crazy. Not only that, you do something for somebody or you do something out of goodwill of your heart and then somebody takes your information and poses it as their own. Okay? Case in point, you didn't paint the Mona Lisa, don't say that you did. <laughs> Alright? It's a masterpiece. It's a work of art. And it comes as a result of hard work from somebody who built a great name who, who painted that painting. Alright? Vincent Van Gogh's Starry Nights. You didn't paint it, don't claim it as your own. Alright? Create your own beautiful work of art, beautiful masterpiece and claim it as your own. Otherwise, give the credit to everyone, all right? I don't give credit um, to myself when somebody even says that I helped them to do something because guess what? One plus one equals two, meaning that even though I may have helped somebody through something, it still takes that person's actions in order for them to get to where they are, okay? When I help somebody to shoot, I cannot shoot the gun for them and make them great at it. They have to go home, practice, do it themselves. So, although I don't get bothered by people telling me thank you and you did it for me, I want you guys to understand, encourage yourself to know that it takes you. When you do something good for yourself, give yourself recognition first, all right? Because it was all you. Anyhow, that was about it, man. This is my little rant and rave for the day. I'm coming home, uh, haven't had a real rest day, had a good vacation in New York this past week, and uh, it really wasn't a vacation because I was up at 7 and down at 12 midnight, so although it was considered a vacation, I never got any good sleep, but I did uh, spend my time usefully. So, going back at it, guys, if you have any type of training need and you're out of state away from me, I will give you a great price to come out and train you. 
all right if you go into my epsta.com and look on my calendar you will find my available dates and uh, we can work something out and I can come and uh, show you a great time and give you a great class that is all from this place over here you know you guys you know I love you because I put out try to put out good information to you I want you guys to stay blessed make sure you train train again and then train some more whatever you do not do on a daily basis you will forget all right y'all have a great one and it's been wonderful